M16-style rifles, shotguns, and handguns have all been used in mass shootings around the country. Most recently in Boulder, Colorado and Atlanta, Georgia. First of all, we need to have what I would call an honest discussion about gun rights. Amos Giora, a law professor at the University of Utah, says Utahns need to be willing to compromise on public safety. The question is, how are we as a society in a place where, frankly, when you hear about what happened in Boulder last night, I don't think any of us really are surprised. The Congressional Research Service defines mass shootings as multiple firearm homicide incidents involving four or more victims at one or more locations close to one another. Ten dead in Colorado Monday and eight in Atlanta last Tuesday. You have to take out the emotion and what you need to do is now look at what are common sense gun laws that could have prevented that. Former Democratic State Senator Scott Howell says conversations about gun laws are heated on the Senate and House floor. He says good dialogue is important. Meanwhile, Giora adds Utah is seated in tradition and that may get in the way of what's right for the state.